Hey guys, this time join us as we delve into the extraordinary journey of Jeff Bezos, from his beginnings to the founding of Amazon and his rise to billionaire status. In this episode, we'll unfold the comprehensive saga of tech tycoon Jeff Bezos and the genesis of his brainchild, Amazon. Our narrative takes a dive into the tempestuous currents of Bezos' life, exploring his early years, vision, and audacious rise to becoming the richest man on earth. Bezos bore the seeds of his future acumen in Albuquerque, New Mexico, where he spent his childhood. Possessing an avid curiosity for science and technology, he exhibited a predisposition for early success. Fresh from matriculating at Princeton University, the young Bezos quit a cushy job at a Wall Street hedge fund and set sail on the surge of the dot-com boom. In 1994, he couched his vision in the ignition of Amazon's flame and online bookstore with an inexhaustible inventory. The birth pangs of Amazon were orchestrated from Bezos's garage in Bellevue, Washington. The infant enterprise was midwife to its grandeur by an initial investment from his parents, a humble nod to family ties that later stitched numerous individuals into the fabric of Amazon's million-strong staff. In 1995, Amazon.com debuts, providing access to millions of books via the World Wide Web. This venture into the then-uncharted waters of e-commerce sparked a revolution so profound that it has colored the world economy in its wake. Bezos' aptitude for innovation and risk-taking drove him to diversify Amazon's operations. Although these ventures sometimes veered into controversies and losses, they ultimately enabled Amazon to compound its patterns of success. An incisive move was the introduction of Amazon Prime in 2005A subscription service that guaranteed gift-wrapped benefits to its users. This bold coup kissed the shambles of the dot-com crash goodbye and revived Amazon's fortunes counted in millions of Technicolor hues. In 2006, Bezos splashed $250 million on the acquisition of an infant audiobook retailer by the name of Audible Inc. Although the world was silently scoffing at this extravagant expenditure, the prudent Bezos reaped major dividends from this venture in the ensuing years. Eventually, the irrigation of Amazon's fountainhead of profitability, Amazon Web Services, AWS, became evident. AWS, launched in 2006, allowed companies to rent computing power delivers from Amazon's data centers, and today accounts for a large part of its profits. Not satisfied with the vast expanse of virtual real estate he'd conquered, Bezos ventured bravely into the uncharted territories of newspapers. In 2013, Newswags vibrated with his startling purchase of the Washington Post for a cool $250 million. Moving ahead to 2013, Bebop. Amazon sheathes its corporate umbrella around Zappos in a deal purportedly worth $1.2 billion. This unprecedented act of acquisition further underlined the tendrils of Amazon in the fabric of e-commerce. The heart of Amazon's empire kept augmenting southwards with the acquisition of Whole Foods in 2017, a move which rocked Wall Street and ruffled the feathers of its competitors. Despite such exponential growth, the sheen on Amazon's armor got tarnished over allegations of cutthroat tactics, worker exploitation, and data leaks. Accusations of antitrust violations and regulatory scrutiny have shadowed Amazon's meteoric rise under Bezos. In the meantime, the seeds of Jeff's philanthropic aspirations sprouted into the Bezos Day One Fund in September 2018. The fund envisages immediate and fundamental aid to the homeless and sustains the proliferation of high-quality education in preschools. Regrettably, hostile scrutiny from the landscape on Capitol Hill is dogging Amazon. Allegations of stifling competition blur the colors of Amazon's canvas. To be returned is Amazon a sum of scrutiny, an unforeseen corollary to its colossal growth under Bezos. As the year 2018 began a decline in industries, the tech industry being no exception, Bezos weathered the storm with the agility of an Olympic gymnast. His protean fortitude veiling the vicissitudes of Amazon retains the enterprise's stature as the globe's most valuable brand. 2019 marked the emergence of a different sort of storm extracorporeal noise on the otherwise impeccable radar of Bezos. Accusations of an illicit affair leading to a $35 billion divorce deal brought into public domain aspects of Jeff's personal life that till then had been the record breaker of privacy boundaries. Embarking on new realms of endeavor yet again, Bezos unveiled the formidable Project Kuiper in 2019. 
The project aims to deliver high-speed broadband internet access to unserved and underserved communities across the globe. Amidst corporeal tribulations and accusations on the personal front, the ebullient Bezos reshaped the contours of the e-commerce sphere yet again with a radical metric at Amazon Employees Health Paramount. The tech titan announced an investment of $1.5 billion in a bid to construct neighborhood delivery stations. Navigating the marbled corridors of Wall Street bears testimony to Bezos' remarkable aptitude. He's a Wall Street wunderkind who wove his e-commerce dream into an economic tapestry draped across the globe. The wealth magnate of our generation, Jeff's regal strides are still blazing a brand new trail in the timeless tango between technology and commerce. Despite drop-dead allegations of conspiracy, entreaties to investigate, antitrust controversies, hostile scrutiny, and dirty linen pitched eagerly in the media's lacerating light Bezos's toil, tenacity and visionary acumen have sutured a saga that chorused the infinite possibilities encompassed within the effulgent mandate of human potential. Beneath the veneer of controversies, the grit of the man who dared to dream and manifested his conception into the colossus that is Amazon— shines undiminished. Every push, pull, and pivot that he experienced came across as an inflection point in the scorching saga that constitutes Bezos's life. As we glance at the imposing edifice of Amazon and Bezos as we know it today, we're struck with magniloquent consternation at the paramount dimensions it has acquired. The multitude of lives that Amazon has succinctly orchestrated into a metronomic ballet under the ceaselessly striving baton of its founder of Phenomena, unlike any in the annals of commerce. Against such a vast canvas, it's easy to overlook the heart of the matter. Amazon is a coruscating tapestry woven innumerable yarns of human endeavor. It echoes the soaring heights humanity can reach when enveloped in the impregnable embrace of tomorrow's possibilities made imminent today. In retrospect, the arpeggios of his life spawn harmonies of astounding entrepreneurial wit and magnetizing contrapuntal risk. Like astro designs converging with finesse, they swirl into harmonious alignment with the gravitational pull of his destiny and the global vocalization of his creation, Amazon. Human prophecy stands transmuted a turning point, etching the timeless wave, the equidistant confluence of all his yesterdays and all his tomorrows, Amazon, crushing inconveniently thrown folktales of impossibilities into smithereens. Hailed alternately as a dreamer and a schemer, bumbler and a bungler, Bezos gazes steadfastly into the future, his undeterred gaze piercing through the flurries stirred by the furies of controversies, from which he always emerges gilded a polished emblem of veritable vision. Bezos today stands amidst the trappings of affluence, born of his singular vision, armored by his wind-tight perseverance and his meteoric rise from the plains of normalcy to the zeniths of wealth only amplify the intense ferocity with which he has encouraged the world to dance to his tune. Insulating against the gales of criticism, Bezos extends Amazon's purview with the pan-relative equanimity of a deity configuring galaxies against the dark tapestry of cosmos. While there remains the roaring chorus of naysayers, the beatific vision of Bezos persists and shapes Amazon into a cataclysmic engine of metamorphosis. The question arises then is Jeff Bezos the sharp-toothed shark of the century after Ford, or the master-piloted great white enigmatic, societally polarizing, a seething cauldron of controversy, unequivocally audacious, yet irrefutably influential. Situating Bezos in the cannels of time, it becomes obvious that Bezos is no Nietzschean superhero embodying a nebulous form of ubermensch. Nor is he the blithely oblivious geriatric concept of capitalists of old who wallow in waist-deep coffers. In sum, Jeff Bezos is undeniably a maestro, smitten with the striking hues of audacity. He conjures immaculate tapestries of charisma, shaping them into the commanding silhouette of Amazon, his talian electrifying melody vivified by the soaring notes of unshattered dreams persistently pursued, a decisive gift to a world that loves to dream. As we stand on the edge of a precipice transcending the confines of the hitherto possible, Amazon's dizzying ascendancy is bolstered by the restless rhapsodies of his tenacious dream. In dystopian days and soaring highs, we are as much on the brink of his creation as he stands on the cusp of our nascent needs. The arrows of time compellingly point north for Jeff Bezos and for Amazon. In the labyrinthine corridors of anticipation, the future resonates with the echoes of their strides. 
Whether these strides alter the course of humanity's journey or Benatar the mellifluous melody of mankind's symphony remains to be seen. The ensemble of Amazon and the anthem of Jeff Bezos are a symphony of evolution, mirroring the inherent tendency of existence to unfurl into a dazzling maze of possibility. Will you join us as this ozone-shattering narrative unfolds against the backdrop of a titillating tomorrow?